first national championship, though. Yeah. Hey, man, we, we working, man. We working. I feel like that's always been the goal for you, though. Each time, even like the Olympic trials, even last year, like the goal was to get the national championship. How's it feel to actually get it this year? I mean, man, it feels good. I mean, I couldn't ask for, for nothing more. I mean, we came here and we secured the, um, the top time. So, I mean, now the next goal is to go to Budapest and, and I mean, do my thing, too. So, yeah. How does it feel, though? You're out of high school now, right? Yeah. How does it feel to be out of high school and be like that full-time pro, not have, to, not have to, like, go into school like that and work as much? And, like, it's, it's, it's definitely different, it has to yeah. be. I mean, it's, it's, it's different a little bit. I mean, the only thing I had to do was just wake up at, like, 8 o'clock. I mean, I mean, I had my own car, so I drove to school. So, yeah. um, that, I mean, just waking up, I mean, and just going to practice after. And then some days after school, like um, some days after high school, I wasn't able to get in the weight room because everything just shut down. So, I mean, sometimes me and my coach would go to um, a 24-hour private gym and get to work in sometimes. But, I mean, yeah. So, I mean, it's, the only thing that's really changed was just like practice-wise. So, yeah. I can practice in the morning instead of going all the way late at nighttime. Is it starting to feel like, did you ever feel pressure? Like, a, as you even, like, started rising up in the ranks, started running really fast in the Olympics, and now coming in, have you ever been feeling that kind of pressure, or, or is you just feeling more relaxed even more than ever? I mean, I'm just, I mean, every race I go to, I mean, I never feel pressure. Like, almost every race I go to, I'm the youngest in the field, and, I mean, and when my time come, it come. I mean, right now I'm just having fun with the sport. Yeah. Um, like, no real pressure for real. I mean, I'm up here, I mean, just to carry the national championship. And now we're trying to go get us some medal at Worlds. And if I do that, I'll be, I have two medals under my belt at the age of 19. So, I mean, I think that's good. That's, that's yeah. crazy because we were just talking to Mia Brahe Pedersen, and she was low-key saying the same thing. Like, take what you have right now, like, at face value. Like, if you're that young, racing on the world stage, or the USA is like, take it at face value. And you've been at the world stage before. You've gotten medals there. Actually, part of that 200 was like, that was crazy last year. That sweep that y'all got and be doing that on home soil. I know you've been off of home soil before, but going across the globe, the Budapest, how are we gonna replicate that, man? Um just just prepare, I mean, just um just listen to what my coach say and just just dial in. I mean we got how many more wish we got? Probably like four? Four? Yeah, something like that. Something four, like that. Four, four, I don't know. four or five weeks, something like that. Yeah. I mean, we, I mean, we got some work to put in. I mean, we got some decent amount of time to get some, some stuff done, um, and, and get ready to peak at, um, at World. So yeah. Now, do you feel like that guy in the 200 when you step on the line, when you race the 200, going against Noah and going against Kenny, going against everybody in the field? Do you feel like you're one of those guys? Oh, of course I do. I mean, I mean, if you go into the race and thinking that you're not one of them guys and you can't mess with the older guys. I mean, your, your mindset gonna be messed up. So I feel like if, if any young person that's racing, an older, an older person just going to the race thinking that you, you that dude, so yeah. Yeah, so appreciate your time, Arion. Best of luck in Budapest. Let's get another sweep. Like, should we bring our brooms out there, bro, you think? I don't know what kind of broom, though, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I mean, we, we got us a good squad to, to do some special things, and whoever wanna break it up gonna have to do something special, too, so yeah. No, for real. Best of yeah. luck, man, best of yes, luck. Yes, sir, thank you.